Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Dear students and audience In this video we will talk about difference between S and V and S and P in terms of genetics So S and V stands for single nucleotide variant uh, while S and P stands for single nucleotide polymorphism Both terms are used in the field of genetics to describe variation at the level of individual nucleotides in a DNA sequence. For example, here we have two individuals. First individual has same DNA sequence except at one nucleotide place where it is A. Second individual has same DNA sequence as of first person but it has G at the same place where the first person has A. So this is a sort of variation between these two individuals and this is called single nucleotide variation in DNA of two individuals and this uh, forms the concept of SNV as well as SNP. So let's have a look at uh, the variation between two terms SNV single nucleotide variant for example adenine to guanine in the previous slide uh, its frequency it can have any value greater than 0% of the population so um, it can be rare or it can be polymorphic it will become single nucleotide when there is a variation whether it is one in 100,000 so it is SNV what becomes SNP single nucleotide polymorphism it can have any value greater equal to or greater than 1% of the population so if SNV is present in at least 1% of, of the population it uh, gets the title of SNP single nucleotide polymorphism so it help, happens only in case of polymorphic it cannot be rare so the only difference between these two is frequency if its frequency is 1% or higher it is SNP if its frequency is less than 1% it is SNV so summary all SNPs are SNVs but not all SNVs are SNPs so any SNV which would be less than 1% of the population that would not be SNP. Both represent genetic change at single nucleotide level among populations. SNPs are more common present in at least 1% of the population. SNVs may be rare uh, present in even less than 1% of the population. Thanks for your attention.